The first time in my life when I met Nene was in 2010. When I was at the law school and she had just entered the law faculty. I will always, always, always do you right. I treat you like a queen. I buy you diamond rings. I swear, my baby, I say no be lie. We had some mutual friends, and so I think I met him through a friend of mine. We were more like acquaintances who would say hello and hi to each other when we met. Until sometime in 2014, we used to see each other in court, and even then, we weren't speaking to each other much. But I think there was once when we were in a court together and it was very packed. And so we knew our cases weren't going to be called anytime soon. So we just started a conversation. And then from there, we, after several meetings, we exchanged numbers and then we started spending time together. Every day after work, he would take me home before going back home every single day. And he lived quite far from me. I was doing that only on friendship level. Um, I think I was just being benevolent. I thought, oh, this man is very considerate. And they made us spend more and more time together. And uh, it turned out to, to be a very good investment. His birthday this year, I had planned for his friends to surprise him at the beach. And on that day, it rained very heavily. She told me she had booked lunch for two at the place around Labadi Beach Hotel. So when it started raining, I said, no, I mean, we can't go to the beach for lunch. And he said, why would we go to the beach on a rainy day like this? But I managed to convince him that I had paid for everything. And so if we didn't go, we'd lose our money. When I got to her house, she came out in a raincoat with umbrellas. And I was wondering, I said, ah, what could that be? I mean, lunch at the beach on a rainy day, well, so I gave her the benefit of the doubt. And when we got there, here were my group of friends. I was so excited, and thanks to Dora. I think that I made him understand the extent to which I would go for him. So July 2015, I proposed to her to be my girlfriend, and she accepted. And then in December 2015, I promised to marry her. I look forward to waking up every day next to him, building a future together, and having a family together, raising our children together, praying together, just spending every little moment of our lives together. I mean, oh, you're